Hello there, it's Abhinav Nirola. I'm back here with my new video. Guys, after that exciting victory for England and super disappointing loss for Pakistan simultaneously in the first ODI, it's time for us to gear up for the second ODI of the three match series where the fortunes are expected to turn around for Pakistan in quite a good manner. Let's preview. Do like, share, and comment on below. Subscribe to my channel as well. On 10th of July 2021, the Lord's Cricket Ground London is scheduled to host this class. One of the many special aspects of the day is that England are allowing a full house in the ground as a test to whether full house can be sustained going forward from now on, at least in England. Anyways, the Mecca is renowned to host high scoring limited over encounters nowadays. Do expect the surface to have a bit of moisture to assist swing bowlers within the first 10 and the batters after that phase by providing efficiency to the ball for reaching up to the bat with necessary and uniform pace and bounce, the spinners might not get much assistance of the deck and hence the margin of error might be very less for them. In conclusion, a flat track is expected to be installed. Rain is expected to interfere in the match proceedings. We might even see the match being called off is what the weather pundits and the cricket pundits are saying. So fielding first should be the ultimate choice for either sides. Plus the bowling unit might use the moisture up front to pick up the ace top order wickets of the opposition and bat with freedom in the second innings if such decision is taken. England Philip Salt David Malan Zach Crawley, James Vince, Ben Stokes captain, John Simpson wicketkeeper, Lewis Gregory, Craig Overton, Bryden Cars, Shakib Mahmood, and Matt Parkinson. They do have limited resources at the moment, but they definitely have unlimited confidence. Well, these guys are definitely considering these matches as county matches and expressing themselves openly. They never looked iffy in their last game because they had their homework done and every Pakistani player was marked with their like-for-like -like threats by them. Credits to the skipper Stokes who seems to have motivated these players to rise against all odds. Pakistan Imam ul Haq, Fakhar Zaman, Babar Azam Captain, Saud Shakil, Mohammad Rizwan Wicket Keeper, Fahim Ashraf, Soheb Maksud, Shadab Khan, Hassan Ali, Shaheen Shah Apridi, and Muhammad Hasnan. Was it a one-off or is it a serious issue? I and most others I admit that it was a one-off. It's still not a panic situation given the last few ODIs went quite well for them. Told you in my last video that Pakistan have that unfortunate tendency to turn into the side of their opposition's quality to underperform big time at times. Well, this series might be Rizwan's final series of this run in ODIs, so he needs to gear up. I actually want to see Sarfaraz and him playing simultaneously as their international stats in England are phenomenal. If the weather conditions allow the conduction of this match with a fruitful result, I'm still expecting Pakistan to win this to take it to the decider on the back of at least one of their top three's extraordinary performance. I just hope that we don't see collapses anymore. Take care.